welcome. It's Neil Dugan here from Conscious of Health, the Body Talk Clinic here in Perth, Western Australia. Continuing on our um, geopathic stress series of um, DVD information today. And what we're going to look at now is electrical stress. So what is electrical stress and how does it impact on our life? So electrical stress is not technically a geopathic stress, it's more of an environmental stress, but it has the much the same type of uh, impacts on your health and well-being, so we're including it in here. Electrical stress that is most commonly um, impacts on people is actually the power cabling within the house. So this could be the cabling in the walls or it could be under the floorboards or it could be in the ceiling for that matter. And uh, where I've found in clinical practice that people get in particular trouble is if there are um, cables near to um, bed, near to the bed, particularly around where your head is, uh, that can cause all sorts of uh, distress. Equally, the uh, configuration of the power cables around uh, your desk at work, where you're working and that type of thing, uh, can also have a, a, a huge impact on your, your health and well-being generally. <clears throat> The second area where people get into all, all sorts of trouble with electrical stress are the very high tension power cables. So uh, depending on where you live, these may be buried under the ground, but they also could also be um, the type of very high um, tension power cables which are on very tall um, poles or masts or um, sort of scaffold arrangements around the, around the city. These, um, these electrical cables cause all kinds of trouble with people's um, health and well-being, particularly if you are um, situated nearby to a, a, um, a small transformer station or even a large transformer station, uh, even the type of thing that might be on the, uh, the end of your, you know, your road within your suburbs. These types of transformers can cause all kinds of troubles in terms of health and well-being uh, for you. So, those are the, um, the common types of electrical stress. Um, as I say, they can cause all of the whole range of illness um, within your, uh, your body-mind system that um, we find in any kind of environmental geopathic stress. And um, it can be as simple as just actually moving away from the, um, the particular stress. If you can sell and buy somewhere where there aren't these high-tension power cables, it's an extremely uh, valuable decision that you can make. Um, but you can also move furniture around and that type of thing in a room to uh, make things a bit easier. And obviously, uh, from a clinical perspective, we have many ways that we can actually work with you to become less sensitive to these things. So um, sometimes it's not possible to actually remove the stress completely out of your environment, but what you can do is you can actually uh, reduce your sensitivity to it. Um, so I hope that's very helpful for you in terms of um, electrical stress, what it is and um, how it works. It can work on a very large scale in terms of the high tension cables, but equally it can be the, um, the battery system in your wristwatch. Um, you know, many people are finding that they're having to take their wristwatch off and making sure that they don't actually wear a pager or a, a cell phone on their bodies or a mobile phone. Um, all of these things, the actual electrical stress from the, um, the workings of it, the actual electrical workings can be enough to actually make you unwell. So um, I hope you found that useful and uh, we'll see you on the next video. Thank you. Hello again, it's uh, Neil Dugan here again. If you've enjoyed watching this short video and you'd like to get more information about this, I have made 20 videos of the most frequently asked questions that people have about the subject of geopathic stress, environmental stress, how it impacts on you as an individual and how your health and your well-being of your family is being affected by this type of stress in your environment. If you would like the information, we have these 20 videos, I'm happy to email them to you. All you need to do is complete the form. You don't need to be concerned at all about completing the form. We will not use your information for any other purpose other than to communicate with you about this valuable information. So please complete the form and we'll get these videos across to you and look forward to um, catching up with you on all this, all this wonderful information. Thank you very much.